Hello there everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Billy with Craft and Cake with Billy. I am so happy you guys are here today. Hope you guys are having a super awesome Monday. And we are coming down to the wire of the 1000 subscriber challenge. And I'm so grateful for everyone who has participated. And if you were not able to participate this time, it's okay. I will have other um, challenges to enter and I will be super grateful to those who decide to do so. Um, before I start with the next two entries, um, I got a couple of Christmas cards in the mail and I wanted to share those with you. Uh, the first one I got, look how cute. It is from, oh my goodness. Hold on, I got a lot of stuff going on right <laughs> Oh, this is from Barbara, Barbara Ford. Thank you, Barbara. I'm sorry, I got a bunch of stuff going on here on my desk and um, I, I forgot for a second, but thank you, Barbara. She made this beautiful little uh, Christmas card and it's so cute and it's got this, I don't, I think it's a little elf and she's writing at her desk. How super cute is she? And it has the Christmas background there. And she has all kinds of letters and just stacks of paper. There's a little bird there. And it says letters to Santa. So cute. And on the inside, uh, she sent me these cute little die cuts here. And some pretty florals and a couple of pretty bows. And it says, Season's Greetings from the North Pole with Love, Barbara Ford. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Barbara. I appreciate that. That's so sweet of you to send me a Christmas card. And it's so cute from Barbara Ford. Thank you. Okay, and then I got another um, Christmas card. And it has this cute little um, snowman on there with some gifts at the bottom and it says every good and perfect gift is from above James 1 17 and this comes from the polka dot pine cone and her name is Monty her channel is the polka dot pine cone I will list everybody's information below she sent me these really cute dies I'll show you in just a second it says may the joy that comes from the Lord find you every day Hope you have a very Merry Christmas. Hugs, Monty. Thank you, Monty. So very sweet. And she sent me some of these Christmas bulbs here. And then a um, cute little round glittery ball. And this beautiful die cut here. And this beautiful Christmas tree. Thank you so very much. I will definitely use this. And I'm gonna sit these to the side so I can uh, start the uh, unboxing of the 1000 subscribers challenge. Um, so the next two challenges are from BB's Closet Creation and Mary Roberts. And um, I actually might do these backwards because I have several things that I need to put together for uh, Mary's, but um, BB's number 19, Mary's number 18, but I'm gonna do this uh, for this one first just because it's closer to me and I have a lot of things to reach for, so um, I hope that's okay. Um, so BB sent this beautiful card here with a teddy bear on it, and it says Christmas greetings, December 15th, 2022. May your Christmas and New Year be especially happy. Hello, Billy. Congrats on your 1K subbies and want to wish you a happy birthday. God bless you and may he give you many more years to come. Wishing you success and thanks for inspiring. Hope you like my humble entry. Crafty hugs and blessings. Happy holidays, BB. How sweet. Beautiful handwriting, BB. Thank you so much. And BB sent this beautiful card here, this tag, and she collaged it, and it is stitched around. Look how beautiful. Thank you, BB. I wish I had the, um, 
the talent of this beautiful stitching. That's something I need to brush up on is sewing. So I love this stitching. So she added some written um, paper here. And then here's a couple of floral pieces. This says garden. There's some music paper and that cute little girl holding a flower basket and then a flower in the corner there. Beautiful work, BB. You are awesome, awesome, awesome. She also sent a couple of tags that I will definitely use in some botanical journals. I love botanicals and I love the muted colors here. Got some lavender there and then the pink. I love those. And then she also sent these cute little vintage looking um, pieces. There's like the ink and the feather pen, some vintage books, and then these cute little map. This is kind of like a vellum, I think. Very, very nice. And then there's this lady who is sewing. And there's some vintage looking paper there as well. So thank you so much, BB. So very sweet. And I'm sorry I didn't do these in order, but I've there's a couple of um, pieces that I need to reach for from Mary. So just give me one second here, okay? Sorry, had a little meltdown. Um, so we're going to move on to the next and it is from Mary, Mary Roberts. And she's actually entry 18, but I, I'm kind of, um, pulling some things from her box cause she, um, sent a few things. So hi, Mary. Thank you so much for entering my challenge. Mary Roberts is such a sweet lady as all of you are, um, so she sent in her entry and she also, before I even open that, she also sent my kids um, little gifts that she made and it was so, so, so very sweet, so very thoughtful and my kids loved them, loved them. Let me show you that first because I want to show you um, and then we'll get to her entry. But look at this. So I have, you guys know I have a three-year-old daughter. And she made her this cute little purse. It is so very cute. And she stitched around it. And it's um, pink, like a soft pink. And it's glittery. And she even added the little clasp there. It is so cute. And my daughter loves it. She was so very excited when she saw her purse. Thank you, Mary. You didn't have to do that, but that is so sweet. And boy, look at the talent. I wish I could do that. So very inspiring, guys. She really is such a sweet lady. And my boys got wallets. She made them wallets. How awesome is that, right? This one has little sharks. And this one is kind of like the comic book with the bam, poof, pow, bang. The little sentiment words, the little words. But these are so very cute and so very thoughtful. Mary, thank you so much. They all love their crafty gifts that you made them. And so sweet. Oh. And uh, Kendall told me to tell you that her name's Kendall and her she has two brothers. So, <laughs> okay, so take those for me. Okay, and okay, 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 great. They're whispering to me, sorry. Okay, so now on to, <laughs> now on to the entries. So Mary sent me this card and it says, happy birthday, how beautiful. That is so pretty. It says happy birthday and she layered it with lace on the bottom and then on top there's this really beautiful almost like a garden scene there's a bird and several 
flowers and then there's a can with some flowers and a butterfly it's so pretty thank you mary oh my goodness let's see it says hi billy happy birthday i hope your day is fantastic your friend mary roberts thank you mary so sweet that's so cute and mary made a vr for my channel and i kind of uh peeked at it so um i do know what she was gonna send and it is beautiful so check out what Mary made. Oh my goodness, look at her beautiful, beautiful ornament. It says, gingers have more fun. <laughs> and she has this beautiful little image here. Oh, and I think it's on that wooden, that wooden, um, that wooden piece there. Oh, cool. Anyway, so she she added some flat back pearls and she alternated the colors, pink, white, pink, white, pink, white. And then it looks like she used the stickles to go around and they are perfectly spaced. Good eye, Mary. That's really good. And then she added this cute little gingerbread man or ginger girl with a cup of hot chocolate and some whipped cream, some chocolate and some um, all kinds of goodies in that mug. It looks like it would be delicious. And look at those cute little glasses <laughs> and that cute little bow. This is too cute. And then she added a cute little gingerbread at the top. I love this. Thank you, Mary. Oh my goodness. Um, she showed on her channel um, some things that she made for a craft fair and they were so very cute. Uh, I think they were little boxes to hold, like hot chocolate and things like that. She's so very talented, very crafty lady. Okay, so I'm going to sit her ornament here. It will be going on the tree. And then she sent me this beautiful, it looks like, um, I don't know if I'm supposed to pull this. I think it's just like a tag. Yes, but it's shabby chic and I love it. If I'm supposed to do something else, please let me know because I'm not sure if this opens or not. It has lace here at the bottom and these beautiful ladies here with the floral headpieces and it says Rose Garden. There's a flat back pearl there and then she added a little lace flower with a flat back. She added this beautiful uh, butterfly applique with three flat back pearls and then some lace at the bottom and this beautiful paper there. I love that paper. And then she also added this cute little dangle and it says lovely. And that it is very lovely. Thank you, Mary. Thank you, thank you. Um, I think I'm gonna start on a shabby chic junk journal. I love shabby chic junk journals, so I think I might start on one pretty soon and I will definitely add that in. That's just perfect. Thank you so much. And then there's one more thing that I need to open here. Look at this beautiful paper. I love this paper. And then she added some washi tape and it is the thicker washi tape, I believe. And I'm gonna sit that here. Thank you, Kendall. Thank you. Okay, so we're gonna open this. Look at that. She made this envelope herself. That's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? Love that paper. I will definitely use this again. And she made this beautiful Merry Christmas card. And the card has a poinsettia and a beautiful Christmas tree, two flat back gems. And then there's like the tool netting on top of some white snowflakes. Beautiful job. And then she added Santa with a couple of deer. And it says, Dearest Billy, I pray that you and your family have a wonderful Christmas. To God be the glory. Your friend, Mary Roberts. 
Thank you, Mary. Oh, and it's on this beautiful sparkly paper. Thank you so much. I appreciate it so very much. And thank you to everyone who has participated in my challenge. Um, the deadline for entries is actually tomorrow. So um, I will be doing the drawing on Christmas Eve, which is the 24th of December. So look for that. And I do appreciate you guys so much. If you are not yet a subscriber to my channel, I would love if you would do that. Uh, I would love to have you here. And guys, I will link everybody's information below so that you can check them out. Please go over and check them out. They are wonderful, wonderful crafters. And thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I hope you have a super awesome day. All right. Bye-bye.